There are thousands of animal species in the world. Scientists classify animals into groups to help us understand the animal kingdom better and describe them in a variety of different ways. It is possible to group animals together based on what they eat. Herbivores are animals that only eat plant material. They gain the nutrients they need from plants and leaves, which store energy received from the sun. Herbivores need wide, hard-wearing teeth to munch on chewy plants. Some examples of herbivores include koalas, kangaroos, cows, sheep, horses, and snails. A carnivore is an animal that mostly feeds on meat. Some carnivores, such as lions, stalk and kill their prey, while other carnivores, such as hyenas, search for already dead carcasses to feast on. Carnivores need very sharp teeth and strong jaws for tearing meat from the bone. Examples of carnivores include tigers, crocodiles, polar bears and wolves. Omnivores are animals that eat both meat and plants. Their diet, therefore, is quite varied. A bear is an omnivore that eats fish and meat, as well as grasses, nuts and berries. Other examples of omnivores are pigs, crows, cassowaries and squirrels. Animals are also grouped based on when they are awake or most active. An animal which is most active during the day is called diurnal. Cats, dogs, deer, orangutans, horses and elephants are all diurnal. An animal that is active during the night is called nocturnal. Possums are nocturnal animals that live in the Australian bushland. Other examples are bats, sugar gliders, platypus, tawny frogmouths, bandicoots and dingoes. Animals can also be classified as vertebrates or invertebrates. A vertebrate is an animal that has a backbone or a spinal column. Crocodiles, dolphins, rabbits, sharks and eagles are all vertebrates. An invertebrate is an animal that does not have a backbone or spinal column. Spiders, lobsters, starfish, scorpions and octopus are all examples of invertebrates.